The Portland City Council has voted to extend the citywide housing state of emergency for three more years. The most recent extension took place last March. At the time, city officials predicted that would be the final extension, but that has not been the case. Emma Jerome live this morning with more on the housing state of emergency and where we stand now. Emma? Portland once again extending the emergency housing declaration, saying they still need more time for a permanent solution to be figured out for the housing crisis that is becoming more and more visible. Last night at a city council meeting, Commissioner Dan Ryan explained a change in city code intended to end the emergency has fallen short of expectations. He says his bureau needs more time to arrange additional code changes, but the emergency declaration is necessary for existing projects to continue. That declaration gives the city flexibility when it comes to zoning. Portland's current zoning code does not allow mass shelters on industrial property, but with the extension of the city, with this extension, however, it says they can bypass zoning laws to build those shelters. Commissioner Mingus Maps voted for the extension, but says doing so indicates deeper issues. This is the sixth time uh, uh, um, this housing emergency has been uh, um, extended. Uh, to me, that points to the need for um, deeper structural change in how we go about um, organizing our attempts to address houselessness. The council voted unanimously to extend the emergency for three years. Earlier this month, Mayor Ted Wheeler used his own emergency powers to create a new homeless service hub to streamline city efforts. Meanwhile, advocates for the homeless say that building these mass shelters is not the way forward. It's not permanent housing, and they have ideas and plans of their own that they've come up with. They say would better tackle this issue. We have those on coin.com. Back to you. Thank you, Emma.